Hey, Dan, Dan, the rock man. So you have some rocks and you want to tumble them. So you got your rocks and it's like, now what do I do? So how do I get them tumbled? All right, so what are you going to buy? You have this tumbler, vibrating tumbler, or you have a rotary tumbler. It would look like that. With the lid. So, do you buy this one? Or do you buy this one? Well, let me show you what happens when you buy this one. It starts coming off at the top and you can't tighten it enough. And then it's going to explode, pop everything off as it already has, and it'll pop the top off. And then it'll start leaking the fluid. We're going to turn that off. But you saw what happened. So it blew its top. And as you can see, see that hole? It just gets bigger and bigger and bigger. All right. So let's take a look at the rocks in there. So, after I bought this and I didn't have success with it, it was blowing its lid, uh, it stripped off the nut, so you can't get it tight. Um, I went ahead and bought this one. Right there. Okay, this one's a three pound rotary rock tumbler. And so if you're gonna buy a rock tumbler, I would suggest you go with the old school rotary and get it filled up and do that. Okay, so there's my tips on rock tumbling. What to buy and what not to buy. Hey, this is Dan Dan the Rock Man. Thank you for watching. And if you have any questions, uh, please feel free to comment down below. And please subscribe if you haven't already. Give me a thumbs up and I'll respond to any um, comments or tell me how you guys have used uh, rock tumbling in order to tumble rocks and see what the results are. All right, see you later.